A lot of people have been asking how I make my stubs in MLB The Show. As y'all can see, we're already hopping right into the action. This video is pretty much going to be some highlights from the most recent event as Chipper Jones just goes yard and then literally the very next pitch of the game, Ellie De La Cruz headed one out of the ballpark. But the way I've been making my stubs is just playing the new events every single week in MLB The Show. As we see Mickey Mansell going yard behind me, this video is going to be the highlights from the most recent events. All of my home runs that I was able to record, there was one point, and we'll get to that in just a little bit, where my recording kind of froze. But as y'all can see, I'm playing the all sets event. Number three, that was after my first win. And the way that I've been making my stubs is getting to 20 wins as fast as I can and selling that 20 win reward for as many stubs as I can. And you can probably tell maybe by the title, the thumbnail, we actually end up selling the Manny Machado for over 1 million, not over, but for 1 million stubs. I don't know why I was saying over, but we end up selling them for 1 million stubs. That is the max on the buy or sell orders and I'm gonna be the show. If anyone wants to go above and beyond, maybe we can get a home run counter going. How many home runs did I have in this video? I meant to count myself and maybe I will while I'm editing this video together and everything and I probably need to, but getting to 20 wins as quick as I can and selling hopefully the 20 win reward every week, which right now this event's going on for about two weeks, but for the last month or two, they've been weekly events. So I've been almost able to make pretty much 1 million stubs every single week and part of the reason those rewards have been so high costing so many stubs is you've been able to use them to get extra progress in whatever program they drop on that friday whatever day they're doing the content usually it's on a friday but they've been having the rewards owing going going towards the progress in those programs so sometimes they're selling for even more or more people are putting in orders to buy the cards for maybe a million stubs and we'll see towards the end of the video just how many people already had an order in for a million stubs i think there was probably maybe at least 15 or 20 total people that were probably able to including myself sell that finest Manny machado for 1 million stubs which is 900,000 there's a 10% stub tax on the market in the game so if you sell something for a million you're losing 10% of that and you get 900,000 after the fact so we're just seeing home runs flying in the background I was kind of planning on commentating a little bit letting y'all know what's happening like oh there's the commerce comet going yard we see him hit a ton of home runs there were games where my opponents would quit after a homer I don't know if we've had one yet, but we're probably going to see games in here where I have opponents who quit and I get a win before a pitch is even thrown in the game. So we definitely had a few super easy, a few absolutely free wins thrown in there. And I don't know if I really like them doing a new event every single week and having to get to 20 wins or 30 wins if you want to get one of those 12 win rewind packs i was actually kind of relieved and pleased to see that this current event was gonna last two weeks because for the last little while it feels like it's been almost two or three months now we've just had a new event every single week and having less than seven days to get to 20 wins every single week like that's just a lot of event grinding that's a lot of mlb the show what we just saw right there is mid event so i'm already at like six or seven wins at that point but mid event they changed it from an 85 overall team cap up to a 99 overall team cap as we get matched up now my first game using all 99s instead of that team that was capped at 85. Now you can use anybody you want, any position, no limits at all in the all sets event. I feel like that's the way it should be for the all sets event, not a cap at 85. It was a little bit weird that they had that in the first place, but my first game using all 99s, we get matched up against somebody playing on the Nintendo Switch. 
and i just don't really see that too often typically if i'm playing this game online it's going to be against somebody on xbox or somebody on playstation but we were just kind of rolling through the events using the all sets right here i was already winning six to nothing might as well go home get thrown out my opponent decided to request a friendly quit after that I really didn't want to accept it. I was winning 6 0. We went ahead, pitched to the top of the third. We got the win easy. And here's what I'm talking about no pitches thrown. And my opponent, maybe because of who I had on the mound, I don't know if I was using John Donaldson or Randy Johnson or what, but before a pitch was even thrown, we got a free win, a win that took no time at all. And because I'm trying to get to 20 wins as fast as possible, I really love seeing when my opponent will quit before a pitch is even thrown right there i would have loved for that home run as we get win number 10 and you'll notice okay i have a lot of these guys already some of them i don't have because i end up selling them i try to sell the 10 win reward for as much as i can and then the 20 wins for example marcus Semyon. i sold marcus Semyon in last week's event for a million stubs and then now i get him for free out of that 10 win pack if i wanted to buy him he would have been about 300,000. there's another person that had just quit before a pitch was even thrown so i had a few of those in this event most events i typically get maybe a handful of people that are just quitting before a pitch is even thrown and there was a 504 foot home run from brian reynolds made my opponent request a friendly quit denied that and ended up making him quit so that 500 foot homer was able to secure us a win ellie de la cruz robbing that next opponent of a base hit and then the commerce comet with the all sets event i was so happy to finally get to use mickey mantle some more and he was just hitting a lot of baseballs into orbit sending him flying around with the comets i realized that I should probably use this Carlos Santana. That's the signature series version of him. 12th homer on the year for me with that card. And it helped lead us to another win in the event. And recently, I don't know if it's maybe because people have been getting more stubs. And you'll actually notice right there the game just froze. Or so it seemed. My recording froze. Now, I didn't realize it till maybe two or three games later. So we had some highlights, some home runs. A grand slam was definitely in there that didn't get recorded, but I had accidentally not realized that my gameplay froze. And by the time I did, I think two or three games, maybe some extra wins had already gone past. This person quit before like they could even get to the main menu. The lineups had loaded in and they already quit. The very next game, I think I hit a 111 mile an hour liner that Rafael Devers just dove and caught out in midair one of the craziest plays i've seen this entire year and as i'm going through this kind of talking over these highlights and everything like that i'm realizing if i want to commentate the gameplay or talk more about the gameplay as i just hit a three run homer i think we're putting that lead up six to nothing the very next pitch jose ramirez gets thrown at but i'm kind of realizing I think that I need to maybe include more gameplay. My opponent, I was saying to myself like, oh, you can't hit the baseballs. And then he was having trouble hitting my guy with the pitch. And he finally was able to hit Jose Ramirez after missing him once. And then that's when he decided, you know what? I think I'm gonna quit this game. And we moved on to the next one in Baltimore. But I'm realizing I probably need to have a little bit more time between pitchers or before the pitch is thrown or something because we're just flying through these highlights while i was editing this video together editing the highlights together and while the baltimore orioles fence that they brought back wasn't able to keep the commerce comet or my team in the yard i'm not giving myself enough time to be talking but also realize what's going on in the gameplay and it's just kind of going from highlight to highlight. That was Ketel Marte, the one from the Extreme Program. My 69th homer of the year. And it was so nice that it made my opponent quit and gave us another win in the event. You see Santander running the other way. My opponent tried to do a hit and run. 
And I tried to fake him out like the ball was going over the fence, but we actually caught it. We doubled him off at first. And if I'm not mistaken, already, like I said, we're flying through these highlights. If I'm not mistaken, I'm pretty sure I'm at 19 wins. And we just took the lead two to nothing. So at this point, bottom of the first inning, I'm only six outs away from win number 20. And I was keeping track on the show app that you can download on the app store. I think you just search MLB The Show. It's called like the show companion app or something like that. And no Manny Machados had been sold. The buy orders hadn't gone down. I had gotten to win number 20. I think I was the first person in the world to get to 20 wins and get this Manny Machado. I also got the 4070 Ronald. You can see right here, sell now Manny Machado for a million stubs. I decided to go to the market and you can see 12 buy orders. So at least the first 12 people to get to 20 wins could get a million stubs from the events. I decided to try to create a sell order, see if maybe I could just give somebody who wanted to buy now the ability to do that but it says there's already a better option available so i ended up just selling the machado for 1 million stubs and that is exactly how i've been making my stubs here in mlb the show 23 just playing these events